So I asked uh, Coach Glasgow a second ago, but how does this new role affect you as a co-defense coordinator? Uh, well, you know, again, working with Coach Patterson is, is an honor uh, for me, uh, working for a guy that's been respected in the, uh, the field for so long. Uh, he, gives us a, he gives me a different insight on how to, how to approach the game and uh, professionally how to uh, become a better guy, coach. And now being a defensive coordinator role, how to, how to get myself prepared for, the, for my next opportunity. Uh, but while I'm here, I'm going to soak them all, soak all his ideas up, and and uh, just try to, you know, make sure I'm, I'm the best at what he was asking me, uh, and any responsibilities as far as my position go. Uh, I have to get the guys ready. Uh, nothing's changed in that regard, but but I do have more of an overall responsibility of, of making sure that the kids uh, at all positions understand uh, what we're trying to go as a defense, and I have to make sure I assist uh, Coach Patterson and Coach Glasgow in, in that role. And that's probably the only difference is now just being a little bit more involved with the, the entire defense versus just my position. Yeah, you have a tough year, uh, tough first challenge, first role, first year in this role, losing six starters on defense, especially all three linebackers. I know those guys were close to you. Uh, but talk about who you see stepping up at linebacker this year. Well, you know, uh, a lot of us are pulling for Sammy Douglas. Uh, he's the one guy that has some experience uh, returning. Uh, the thing um, with the rest of the guys, they're just all young, you know. Uh, there are no other defensive snaps uh, on the roster at the linebacker position. So, uh, really, those guys are, you know, they're just young and hungry. Uh, it's you know I have a, a responsibility just to try to get those guys to relax and, and take in the, uh, the defensive package. You know we do a lot of we're multiple in a lot of different ways. So I have a responsibility just trying to calm the guys down and, and again just put them in position to make plays and, and do it within the scheme and not try to come out and, and be gangbusters, but just really let the game come to them. And, and if we can if I can get that done, uh, I think we'll we'll have a good transition year. Mm -hmm. After losing those seniors from last year, yeah, Sammy made a lot of impact plays on special on special teams last year. How does he translate that over to a regular guy on defense? Um, you know, I, I think similar to his first year. You know, he didn't make a lot of plays on special teams his first year, but he was out there. So uh, we're hoping, you know, that this year would be his breakout year in the defensive uh, role. You know, he's fast, he can run, he's gotten tougher, he's put on weight, you know, he's done all the right things off the field. Uh, but again, like anything else, I think the confidence of when you make plays just goes through the roof. And, and until he can make some of those plays, you know, he's just still a little bit, you know, shell shocked and now being a starter. So, uh, you know, hopefully he'll have a good camp. And if he does, then, then you know, he'll hopefully, you know, get the season off uh, to a good start in Minnesota. Thanks, Coach.